it just seems to me like this they have like this plan of we don't want to run Josh Allen because you know we want him healthy for the playoffs you know the the long-term career for Josh Allen it's more beneficial for him to be a pocket passer than running I get all that I I truly do um and that's fine with me on paper um but you also have Josh Allen in his prime right now in part of what has made him so good throughout his career is that threat of the run um it opens up our run game it if he's the leading rusher it is what it is but at least we have a ground game um it makes the RPOs more effective it opens up the passing game um they have to you know give one or two players on the defense to start spying the quarterback and that gets you some mismatches um I'm all for, you know, wanting to protect the longevity of Allen's career. I'm all for, you know, the idea of wanting to him to be healthy in the playoffs. Um, but the NFL is hard and, you know, kind of forcing yourself into playing left-handed, like in the hopes that when you get to the playoffs, it all works out for you. It's kind of what they're doing right now. And it's not really working, um, even against you know, these bad teams that you should be putting a beating on, like the Giants, the Patriots. Um, it, it's not working. Um, and pretty much every game since the Jacksonville game, I mean, we're seeing the offense kind of look listless. I guess it was a little bit better in the Bucks game. I'll give them that. Um, but the offense just kind of looking meh. Boring, vanilla, not maintaining possessions. Um, putting themselves in third and longs and you know all of a sudden fourth quarterbacks against the wall and they kind of unleash Josh Allen and we hit this tempo um, and Josh Allen's letting it fly he's running you know he's doing all those things and then all of a sudden in the fourth quarter our offense looks unstoppable.